Check out the instructor's comments at the end of this video for more info. Alright, we're doing a set of R1 carburetors here. You can see the bike we're working on and uh, Lexi, our student here, found a problem that kind of sucks and this is why we test our work and we, as many times as we try and see things, sometimes we don't see it until it's uh, too late and what she noticed here, you can see amazing in the video, is this big gap and how Lexi noticed it, Lexi, why don't you say it in your own words, how did you notice that? Well, I was installing the carburetors, uh, tightening up the uh, screws for the boot that go to the engine. Uh huh. And I was looking at it, and I thought I saw the ring that goes to the boot inside for the spring. And I was, and I kind of was looking around with my flashlight and got closer and. I noticed there was a bigger gap in there than just the ring. That's what I'm really looking for, Lexi, right there, is that part of uh, being a mechanic, every mechanic should know, is what she's starting to build into her muscle memory there and doing a good job with, is that we always want to compare multiple, you know, areas. And as you zoom in with the camera, we can even see it looks like there's a pretty big gap on this one, too. Um, but this is a problem because that that chamber there needs to seal. Now watch this. We're going to go ahead and do a test. We showed in other videos where we put light air pressure to actually force the slides to lift with the engine not running. Go ahead and do that. Yeah, you can actually watch it pushing out of there. That's not good. That is not a sealed chamber. Watch the slides actually actuate here with this test. Go ahead. Look at that. What's wrong? It's not moving. It's not moving at all. How's that going to work on the motorcycle? It's not going to. All right, here we'll just go ahead and test the other two slides here again. Look at that. Beautiful. Okay, but let's take it a step further. At least, now this is much, much easier to do on the bench because we can't test the other side of the cap right now. We can't see it, but the slides are actually working. Go ahead and do that. We see nice, even areas here, and we're not seeing the problem like we have here. So we got some work ahead of us, but I'd say that's a better catch now. You know, as much as we'd want to catch it on the bench, yeah. this is a thousand times better than it being in the customer going out there and the bike running on three cylinders. So yeah. good job. Thanks.